good, everybody? Welcome back to the Blitz City Podcast. I'm your host, Kobe Orr, where we have breaking news. Jackson State, you have another quarterback of the class of 2024 who will be joining the Jackson State roster. His name is Ethan Terrell from Louisville, Texas. He's a three-star quarterback, and man, y'all really got y'all one with this kid. So we're going to dive into him, and I'm going to show y'all just what kind of quarterback y'all are getting. All right, so first... Ethan Terrell, like I said, is of the class of 2024. He's from Louis Louisville, Texas, where he attended Louisville High School. All right. He's 6'2", 6'2", 189 pounds. So he'll hit 200 pretty soon. All right. He has a career record of 23-4 and four as a starter. He was first team all district, and he was a unanimous 6A offensive newcomer of the year. Okay. Let's dive deep into him, though. At 6'2", 189 pounds, and this is coming from me, he has good size and he has good accuracy. What's even better is his release. His release, his throw on the run, his footwork, his poise, his pocket presence, his decision making, his touch. Everything about this kid is what I love. I get excited about a lot of kids, but only few, only few of them do I think will actually really do something special, like special in the college careers, I think this is one. Remember when y'all got, uh, what's his, what was his name? PJ Hatter, who decommitted and went to Texas State. This kid is just as good, just as good. Remember how excited y'all were for the future with PJ? He's just as good. Ethan Terrell is just as good as that kid. So let me tell you, he just got the it factor. This kid just has the it factor, okay? He takes over games, he throws he throws the football with such high velocity, man. Oh my goodness, the arm strength is there. The velocity is great. His throws are always in line with his wide receivers, which is what you can tell. But his, ooh, his running ability, I, I swear he'll turn that speed on and he'll get himself right past the secondary if he has to, okay? He had offers from Air Force, Jacksonville State, Northern Arizona, Mississippi Valley, Navy, Sam Houston, Austin, P, and Texas Southern, uh, and of course, y'all. So that would make four FBS offers. Four times this kid could have went uh, FBS, but he chose Jackson State, which is a great decision, by the way. Guys, you got a legitimate FBS quarterback, which, I mean, you already had like a few of them, but you got another one. But man, this kid, like I said, just as good as a prospect as P.J. Hatter uh, was when he was committed to y'all. And now he's at Texas, Texas, uh, that Texas school. Y'all should be very excited about this. Y'all should be very <laughs> excited about this. I like this kid. Um, this was a very late announcement, but it is what it is. Y'all got, y'all got one. Y'all got one. So let me know what you think down below about Ethan Terrell, because when I say his poise, man, you gotta love the poise. He's as calm as they come in that pocket. Cool, calm, and collected in that pocket. I swear. You you really got you a dog. He's not he's not just a great athlete playing quarterback. He's not one of those usual scramblers who's fast and they have an arm but no accuracy. He has all of those things. Again, you're watching the Blitz City Podcast. I'm your host, Kobe Orr, and I'm out. Peace.